So hi guys welcome to my youtube channel aqua station so in this video i am going to discuss about how to tell if your molly fish is pregnant or not so molly fish is a live bearer fish meaning the babies come out of the mother alive breeding occurs easily and often for the molly fish if males and females are in the same tank so baby molly fish will be eaten if kept in the same tank as any other fish including mollies so it is very important to identify the pregnancy in the female molly or typically molly fish pregnancy last between 20 and 40 days and they will have between 20 and 100 babies at a time so during their pregnancy in molly fish a molly fish goes through several physical and behavioral change that can be easily identified by a naked eye so the first sign become visible 7 to 10 days after fertilization while other appears throughout the pregnancy so here are some of the important and the most common way to identify if your female molly is pregnant or not so the first sign is swollen belly the most apparent and the easiest sign to spot in pregnant molly is a swollen or the enlarged belly so look for the stomach to change the pregnant molly fish stomach will begin to grow bigger and stretch out however the sign is usually relevant in the last few weeks of pregnancy as mollies don't develop a swollen belly immediately after often fertilization so number 2 sign is gravid spot it is a dark triangular spot has arrived near the anal vent of the female molly you will also noticed a blackish spot on line running down her stomach which are the eyes of the fry the pregnant molly's body will also continue to become rounder as her pregnancy progresses moreover the black spot isn't visible on darker color molly's so you will have to keep an eye out on their abdomen of your pregnant female molly and the number third sign is aggressive and isolated behavior it's quite normal for female molly's to become protective and slightly aggressive to other other tank mates during her pregnancy but more than frightening molly's prefer hiding and isolating to protect themselves so in the last week of gestation you will notice that your molly fish will become slight significantly more isolated and will spend most of its time near the bottom of your tank and the fourth sign is changing appetite so after fertilization a female molly's appetite starts increasing to meet her increasing nutrition needs so you will notice that she become extra active during feeding time and might even fight other fish for food so make sure there's enough to eat for everyone in your tank but as the laboring stage nears the molly's appetite will start decreasing and she will spend more time in isolation so when you identify these signs these are a good chance that your molly is very close to giving birth So this is usually a good times to start making preparation for the laboring process. So these are all information regarding how you can identify whether your molly fish is pregnant or not. I hope this video will help you. More videos are coming soon, so please stay tuned to my channel.